What's going on guys? Today we are going to talk about a topic in Red Dead Redemption 2 Online which is going to be a tactic where you can make anywhere between 50 to approximately $100 within an hour or less or maybe a little more. Just depends on how, what type of spawns the animals are going to take what type of gear you have, etc. But I almost didn't want to make this video due to the fact that if Rockstar finds ways people are making money in this game, they, they will patch it, guys. Like, for, remember before patch 1.07 where you, you couldn't, you could actually just get so much money off of like heron plumes and uh rosate spoonbill plumes and that and other birds and other types of animals well those those days are over because rockstar had to go and stealth nerf all the animals values in the game however today we're going to talk about something that hasn't been patched yet and you can do this. And all it's all you're gonna need is a fishing rod. You're going to need worm bait, cricket bait, and a at least a special rubber lure and a special spinner. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your map. You're going to go over to the lower part of the Dakota River. And you are going to go to this little island right here that's on the river. Because what's going to happen is there's going to be an air. This is going to be an area where uh, salmon are going to spawn. And you can, uh, you can fish in this area. And if you can catch 10 of each fish. So if you catch 10 Salmon, I'm, I'm going to show you right here. Just, just as proof. You can only get like 10 of each fish. See how I only got like 10 sockeye salmon? You can only get 10 of those. I, I know I'm repeating myself, but it's whatever. So, 10 of those salmon are going to be worth at least $25. But this is just the tip of the iceberg. Because... If you have enough bait by the time this area is done, we are going to go all the way down the Dakota River and go to this location right here. This little island, tip of this island right here that's going to be under this, uh, under this, uh, railroad bridge. And I'm going to show you, uh... I'm going to show you where this is. I'm going to take this step by step. And we're just going to go down here. I'm probably going to jump cut this more than likely. So. Yeah, let's just do that. Keep going down here. Here's the area, the general area of where you want to go. And yeah, guys, here we are. This is more than likely going to be a jump cut. And this is the area where you want to be at. The little tip of this island right here. Now, you're going to want to get out your fishing rod. And you want to get out. There, there's a glitch where well, if you ever go slightly under this bridge, you will not be able to 
um, equip your rod and it'll just close on you. But just, just be really careful of that because this is a good area to fish. Equip your special spinner or special river bait. I mean, lure. And then equip either cricket bait or worm bait. And what's going to happen is that there's going to be a lot of largemouth bass and there's going to be a lot of steelhead trout that I'll be spawning. If you get 10 of the largemouth bass, that's going to be $20 right there. And then if you get 10 of the steelhead trout, that's going to be another $25 right there. But that doesn't quite finish our journey yet about where I'm about to tell you. There's going to be this area that in Valentine where if you go to the butcher and then take this little trail right here, go all the way down this hill and then to this pond right here. Well, not pff, pond. What am I saying? The river right here. There's going to be an area of northern pike spawning. And northern pike in this game from my knowledge, are is the most valuable fish in the game. You can make at least $8 off of one northern pike. And you can stow that on your horse and just keep repeating the process. So, that's the general information of the fish, the plentiful, valuable fish locations in this game, from what I know. And it's worked for me. I have made it between 50 to to $100 per hour doing this tactic. And I highly recommend it to you guys if you just want to make some money in this game. Because I don't know if, I don't know if Rockstar is going to uh, patch the animal values again and make it better or worse. But for now, this is a good tactic how you can make money in the game. Um, I hope you like my video and information on this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you very much. I'm signing off.